Yeah, so here's the kitchen. I just put the repaired track light right up there. So I've got one extra position now. Just turn them on here. And then I've got the three over here. These two shine down on the stove. And then this one over here shines down over the sink. And now I've got this light up here is shining down on my espresso machine. And then I've got these three picking up the uh, counter. So yeah, that, I was just looking for a little more light. These LEDs are a little narrower beam than the halogen bulbs. So you have to have a few more lights. So I've got five and a half times seven bulbs. So that's what, 38 and a half, 39 watts. I've got a five amp fuse for this circuit. So I'm still under the five amp fuse and I've got plenty of light now. I'm glad I didn't throw any of these away because this one was dead. And I believe two of the other ones, I think one of these and one of these were also had died. And then I picked up this one different lamp. It's a different style than the other ones. So I've got one odd ball, but I'll keep it. it takes the same kind of bulbs. So these are 23 year old lamps, but they are running on solar power now. And as you can see outside, it is dark. That doesn't matter. I've got a battery bank. So these are running off of sunlight that was shining earlier today. And let's see what kind of current I'm running here. So what I'll do is I'll go take a look at my ammeter. Okay, so here I have the lights on, 5.37 amps coming out of the battery. So let me go turn the lights off and then we can take a look at the current drops too. So 5.37. Okay, so I turn the lights off, the current's still dropping a little bit. It's pretty much stabilized. So there's 3.1 amps. It was 537. Now it's 225. So that's a little over 3 amps, 3.15 amps. And that's at, let's see what the voltage is here. So we're at 12.6 volts. So yeah, pretty close to the advertised power on those bulbs. If we're running 39 watts, let's see 12.6 volts and there's a little over three amps. Yeah, it's still falling a little bit. That's my capacitor kind of soaking up the difference there. Yeah, maybe 3.2 amps to run seven 5.5 watt LEDs. That was less than the power of one of the original 50 watt bulbs. And I used to have six 50 watt bulbs in there. Now we've got seven five and a half watt bulbs and they put out about the same amount of light. I've been running those lights for over two years now. I put them in in August of 2013. It's September of 2015. So they work just fine. They work just like a regular light. The only difference is that current is coming out of these batteries. It's still a mess. I'm in the process of getting the wiring sorted out, but these batteries have been running those lights for two years without any problem. So if you have any questions about the lights, I'll uh, try to answer those. Put that in the comments section below. And as always, thanks for watching.